Hey guys, welcome to another WTF First Impressions. I have a very special little bag right here. I initially was just gonna do the $52 eye defining pen because I think that is absolutely ridiculous. I also got distracted by pretty things at the counter while I was picking up the one item. I ended up grabbing two more and I thought I would just sit down and do not necessarily a full face of Tom Ford, but try just more than just the eyeliner. I already know I'm a huge fan of Tom Ford eyeshadows. I have several of the quads. It's become a bit of a thing. I love it. Every time I go to a Tom Ford counter, I'm just like swatching and I'm like, ooh, do they have anything new? And this was a newer launch and the colors were so, so beautiful that I couldn't resist. The quad is $80. That is way up there in price. But if you are super picky about eyeshadow, Tom Ford shadows are excellent. I did also pick up a lipstick, which is $52. I'm having a bit of a love-hate with Tom Ford lipsticks right now because they go bad really quickly, which is such a huge drawback, especially when you are paying such a ridiculous amount of money. But I have tried hundreds of lipsticks on the market and there really isn't anything else color-wise like the Tom Ford collection. The colors are just super flattering. They wake up your whole face. They look good on a variety of skin tones and they are just phenomenal. So let me zoom you in just a little bit and we will get to playing with the product. I look so strange without any of my eye makeup on. Oh my goodness. So we are going to start with the lipstick and this is what the box looks like. Everything through and through, very fancy and beautiful. This is the shade Indian Rose and I have heard a lot of buzz about this color that it is a must have and I have never tried it. Something nice about these as well is they hydrate the crap out of your lips. Your lips do not get chapped. It does not bunch up. It does not lift. It does not separate. It's just a beautiful lipstick. So um, there we have that. This is new. This is the Disco Dust Quad. Of course, you get your unnecessary little sleeve. Ooh, this is so pretty, right? Look at that shimmer shade. That is just gorgeous. I love Tom Ford shimmery shades the kind of more glittery metallic ones because they are the ultimate sophisticated glitter. Tom Ford sparkles are supposed to be reminiscent of an evening gown and really just gently pick up the light instead of just being like, ba-bam, like glitter. You know, which sometimes that's fun too. There's a time and a place for everything, but I really love the sheen that um, this type of a shadow provides. No one else does it like him. And these are best applied with your fingertips. I'm going to take a fluffy brush. This is from NARS and I'm going to take the lightest shade right here. And I am just going to kind of pack this on the lid everywhere. And I am just going to take this really shimmery, beautiful shade and just pack it all over the lid. And I'm gonna skip the pinky tone shade today just because I'm going for something a little bit natural. I know this is metallic and shimmery and sparkly and I am gonna do the felt tip liner and I think I am gonna put on a lash, but I am just so into keeping the lid clean right now. We all go through our phases with makeup and currently this is just more fresh, awake and just feels more comfortable for me to wear. So I'm just keeping everything really bright. Um, that being said, let's go in with this $52 liner. You do get two sides on here, which kind of helps you justify the price a little bit. So you get one side that is super freaking itty itty bitty, which in my mind, I'm like, ooh, this is fantastic for concealing a lash band. And then this other side is a little tiny bit chunkier. It's not thick by any means, but you're gonna be able to get an actual line. And I'm actually gonna start on the center of my lid. That was ridiculously easy. I don't think I've ever put on a wing so quickly without it like bleeding into the lines on my lid. What the heck? What sorcery are you? 
All right, we're going like full potential with the wing. We're really like, we wanna see the wing. I wanna see if this stays dark or not or what. So I'm just, I just went with it and it's like a big strong wing today, but that went on so nice. I am going to put on my mascara and lashes and I will be right back and we'll chat about this just a little bit more. This is kind of crazy to me. And we're back and I'm lashed and loving life right now as far as my makeup is concerned. The liner went on beautifully. I am really blown away because I really was thinking that I was gonna be like, oh, how is it gonna compete with my top shelf liners? Right here in my top drawer, I keep a liner from Ico. I have my Essence waterproof liner, which is like $3, which is great, by the way. If you don't have the money to splurge, nor do you want to splurge on something like the Tom Ford liner, don't. You can, you know, get it done for three bucks. And then this one from Physicians Formula that just launched is really good too. So I have options already on hand of things that I enjoy, but I have to say that liner just like glided on like I didn't have to use any pressure it was just like light as a feather nothing was bleeding or bunching up I have an issue where sometimes the line will get kind of like jig jaggy and you really have to kind of lightly tug at the eye and really try to smooth things out or I'll go on top of it with a slanted eyeliner brush and sometimes that will help sometimes it's frustrating and then you end up making your liner too thick and we have all been there where one eye is behaving and the other isn't and for a first time try of this eyeliner I love it I freaking love it so much now this just went on so I'm gonna have to see if a couple hours from now if it is still really intense in pigment if it transfers if it's bleeding at all if it fades you know all the usual stuff as far as the eyeshadow I already know like thumbs up really really beautiful color selection and the lipstick Indian Rose is feeling really nice look at how sharp that wing is though right and I didn't even have to clean that up it is such a gorgeous day in California we're at the Americana. What is this? I don't know what this is here for, but it's really cool oh, looking. Oh, I know what it is. Huh. It's Chinese uh, Lunar Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. All right, you guys. So I'm going to zoom you in. This eyeliner is amazing. Um, the eyeshadow and lipstick, it's kind of like, yeah, it's great. But oh my gosh, this liner is so good. I want to know what James thinks. Oh, okay. You know what? Pretty off. Right? There's a train coming. I mean, is this a mall or Disneyland, right? This looks amazing. I'm so excited. And spicy edamame, my favorite. All right, so it has now been several, several hours and my foundations, I need some powder. But that's not what this video is about. It's about the liner. Can we look at the liner? Holy moly, oh my goodness. I really like it, you guys. The lipstick, the liner, the magical glitter thing going on on my eyelids, it is so good. I cannot even believe that I like this liner so much. It's ridiculously expensive. It's stupid expensive. It's a pretty awesome liner. It really, it really is, good. right? It hasn't faded, it hasn't moved. Around four o'clock, I've had this on for and it's still looking still looking fresh the one thing about doing a really strong wing like this i really didn't do anything to the lid i just kind of packed on some of that little shimmery stuff the wing done so that is my check-in for now and i will see you guys a little bit later peace from me and my sharp wing i got puka a doggy cupcake from sprinkles how adorable he loves these so much puka Hi, baby. Hi, my baby. Oh, you're getting me a toy? Oh, no? Oh, hi, little boy. Look what I have for you. Do you see this? Are you excited? Yeah? Sit down. Is that good? Is that good? Yeah. <laughs> Turn around. Sit. Up. Sit. Okay, don't joke. Mmm, yummy. And the, des See. the desperation kicks in. Let's try to find any little bit that fell on the floor. 
This is the most generous box of product I think I have ever received ever. I'm kind of losing it right now, you guys. I'm losing, I'm losing it. Oh my God. So much stuff from Lancome. Look at all this. Ooh. I'm tired. Um, my makeup looks like crap right now, except for my eyeliner, which is still holding up strong. Oh my gosh, $52 for an eyeliner. I really thought that I would be against this so passionately. I thought I would be like, do not spend so much money on eyeliner when you can get a good one from the drugstore. Because yes, you can get great from the drugstore, but this is like above. This is like next level. This is like eyeliner dreams come true. I mean, I have had this on all day long it's still sharp it's still really intense it hasn't like bunched up i'm just in heaven with this i cannot even get over how much i freaking love this i'm getting too excited the glittery situation on my lids i kind of knew i would already like it because i have other quads from tom ford and they just wear really beautifully this is like 10 plus hours and there's still stuff on the lid and mind you that's all i put on my lid it hasn't fallen beneath the eye it's still there it's looking beautiful doing its thing as far as the lipstick goes i'm going to try and find a dupe because i think 52 dollars for that particular color is just too much it didn't wow me to the point where i'm like yes we all need this whereas spanish pink is kind of that type of a color Indian rose I think is not that unique so that's just my take I hope you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you like this week's WTF and I will see you guys in my next video but wait oh a my second. god you scared the crap out of me I literally like jumped I think that this liner was amazing and I love the shadow I'm here I'm doing wings for you the lipstick oh my god you're letting me do this are you joking me the lipstick, however, was just ordinary. I mean, it was nice and it was fine, but I mean, big deal about the lipstick. The shadow. Oh my God, my... look how quick I was able to achieve that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. No, thank you. <sighs> so. Like I said, what eyeliner dreams are made of. Yeah, on that note. That is so hilarious. Oh, you are like fierce right now. All right, thank you guys so much for hanging out. Hey, um, I'm gonna finish James's makeup, and would, um, we're calling it we're calling it a night. I've got an idea. What would you guys like to see most? Me do her makeup. Yeah, never mind. That's that's the only option. Me doing. Would you like to see me do her makeup? Because you're not gonna do makeup on me. I no. kind of just did. N that doesn't count. They can't Ooh, see it. <laughs> all right okay we're calling it a night I'm yeah getting give weird. me something all right <laughs> all right no get away get away get away all right thank you guys so much for watching i hope you're having a fabulous leave evening. a comment below if you want to see me do her makeup mm -hmm. and thumbs okay. up this video. all right bye you guys Mwah. <laughs>